The comedian's loyal followers were positively heartbroken. They really were about his upcoming departure. But probably nobody was happier than his favorite targets, cable news networks, like here at CNN, but especially Fox News. I wonder what's going on at that other network that doesn't suspend or fire their employees for backing political candidates, but instead goes ahead and hires the actual candidates, thus cutting out the middleman. These people are putting their lives on the line for us. Show respect. So f*** you and all your false patriotism. But what we were ridiculing was the way you exaggerate the scope of public assistance abuse through random, often unprovable anecdotes, hour-long specials, and for some reason, this hand bursting through the heart of America. <laughs> Yes, I simply would like to know, as an honest and balanced news person, when you're going to pull your Stalinist head out of your Leninist ass and listen to real Americans. Healthcare bill includes death panels. Ooh, that one was PolitiFact's 2009 lie of the year. Fox News is, is like a lying dynasty. Oh my God, Fox has been outsourcing even their bull <laughs> manufacturing jobs. This is crazy. The idea that is what John Stewart yeah. did only. Uh, Liberal-oriented stuff is wrong. It is wrong. And, However, and he went after the left. He went after political but, but correctness. That, but I, I would submit to you, Carl, that is liberal. Liberal is not no, defending you, the Democratic Party. It's yes. going after all sides and, in power and, and questioning CNN, all authority. very often, the networks. He, he, was, he was hitting all around the yeah, infield I thought there were and times, the outfield. I thought there were times where he took cheap shots at CNN, but there were a lot of times where I found myself agreeing with him. And I think some of the bosses here did, too. That was the genius of Jon Stewart. He was a media critic. If they hire someone who's just a great joke teller, it'll still be a funny show. It'll It'll lose its social relevance. I want to see them still be a media watchdog mm. as well as a watchdog of the two-party system. Me too. We also need to look, though, at the repertorial manner of Jon Stewart of finding, mm. going back to the clips and say, look what Cheney said on December 31st that you, the mainstream media, forgot.